how to add price formula to your products on Shopify using price list. So if you specialize in selling products related to customer specifications such as carpet or frames and you wish to set price based on the size chosen by the customer, then a price list is suitable for you. You can create your own customized price list and determine charges based on the customer's product area. So let's first have a look at uh, the product. So this is the product which is carpet and we are selling it on the basis of the area. So if I want uh, 5 meters into 5 meters, the price is 650, uh, 625 for me. So this is in centimeters and the calculation is 500 divided by 100 into 500 divided by 100 which is 25 uh, meters uh, square meters. Uh, in this area I have selected centimeters, you can also select uh, meters if you want. Uh, just to be more specific or more uh, detailed sizing, I have chose uh, the centimeters. So if I want 536 into 536, I can do exactly that and the price will change according to the size that I selected. So let's see uh, how this works. The first step is to install the Live Product Options app from the Shopify App Store. The link is in the description. And now let's move ahead to Shopify Admin Panel. Once you have completed the onboarding process, you land on a home page. I have already adjusted the settings, but if you are new, you can click on Add New Products or New Product Options. So I'll show you the settings. In Product Targeting, you have two options, Single Product and Multiple Product. Uh, let's go to Product Options, just below that. Click on Add Options and select Dimensions in the Type section. You have many options over here to select from, for example, image swatches, button swatches, text or upload file or discount, quantity discount. So you have multiple options. Uh, I'll be very specific uh, with the topic, which is price list. So I'll, I won't be uh, going deep into the dimension and all. So this is the name. You can select the name, for example, area and the label. I have not selected any label over here. Uh, you can choose the label for X dimension and Y dimension. Uh, I have not selected here, but you can. For example, W for width and high, H for height. So this will automatically appears over here, but I don't want this for now. And you can uh, click on or choose your add-ons. For example, this, this is the centimeter. So if I want, I can just change it. And you will see it will go back to small cases. You can also initially put the value, for example, five. So the initial value will be five for both of them. Uh, not five, let's keep it uh, 100, which is one meter, one meter square. So if the customer wants to edit, they can edit it or you can they can just buy the one meter square feet area. You can also go for the rounding decimals. If you want, you can go up to 10, 20, whatever decimal points. So what it means by decimal. So if the customer types uh, 10, uh, one, but I'll show you the decimals. For example, two decimals. So if the customer types 0, 0 0.30, it will go to 100.3. 0, 0 and if the customer types this, let's keep it one decimal or maybe like zero decimal, let's keep it zero decimal. So if the customer types 30 or three, it will go back to 100. It will go to the shortest or the nearest one. So if I type nine, it will go back to 101. So this is all about rounding, but I won't keep this for now. Now let's go to advanced setting. Uh, you can type your info and help. You can choose the minimum X and the minimum Y. Uh, in this case, I can put uh, 50 centimeters into 50 centimeters as minimum. So if I go below 50, it will show me an error like this. Must be at least 50 centimeters. Uh, you can also uh, make it the maximum also. Maximum X and maximum Y. So if I go beyond uh, 1000, it will show me a message. Must be at least 50. Uh, you can also choose X always bigger or Y uh, single input and this is the text template. So the text template is uh, the input of X upon 100 into text of Y upon 100. So and this is the exact uh, in the calculation area. I want the calculation to be in uh, centimeters. I want the customers to put the centimeters and get uh, meters as the output. So this is the calculation. And this is the text uh, template. So if I change the X axis, it will change it over here and if I change the Y it will change it over here and the rest remains the same uh, and this uh, the area also changes uh, according to this so 
this will be like half into 200 which is 100 which is 1 meter square so this is the result the calculation is right uh, also we have a price list so click on the three buttons and you can choose the price list how to create a price list price list i'll show you uh, in a while and these are to show the labels the labels over here so the customer can get a clear clarification for what uh, they are exactly getting and what is the price of that so this is the 50 uh, and also we are doing one thing over here so the moment customer increases the per square fit area the price will eventually decrease uh, for example for 100 into 100 the price is 50 dollars per square feet but if i go uh, beyond that it will decrease the price over here i'll show you how i have done this so we'll create a price list so go to the library options app click on assets go to lists then click on list and then click on new list so you can create a list from here you can choose the price list area because we are calculating according to the area i'll show you the uh, list i have created so this is the area i'll show you the list so this is how it is calculated uh just a second i'll remove this option uh, one so for the zero area the price is 50 so until uh, it is two the price will be 50 if it goes about two meters the price will go for 45 if the area goes about above four or it remains four the price is 40 same with 6 35 8 30 and 10 25 so let's test it out <clears throat> if the area is under two the price is 50 dollars per square feet so it will cost me 50 dollars if the area is one square meter if the area is two square meters this will decrease as i have uh, shown over here it will cost me 45 dollars so 4 into 45 is exactly uh, 160 uh, let me calculate uh, 45 45 90 90 it's 91 it, it should be 180 i guess okay so we have we have uh, reached the uh, 4 area so the price will be according to 40 so it's 80 plus 80 60 160 so yes this is the exact price so we have crossed uh, we are almost 4 square meters so per area square fit will be 40 so that means 14 to 4 160 dollars if the customer goes above uh, suppose this is 64 square meters this is about 10 meters so the cost will be around 25 dollars per square fit so this will be 25 into 64 which is almost uh, which is 1600 dollars so you can create a price list and click on save list after you have done you can go to your products and choose the list from here so this is it for the area just click on save and enable so the price list for your product option is done i have used the live product options app so check out the live product options on shopify app store link is in the description it offers real-time custom product previews for your online store super easy to install and great for personalized items it's a game changer for any e-com store uh, if you have any questions let me know in the comments and see you in the next video